Welcome everyone to HFN. Also, we're known as HUFN News. Today is March the 23rd, 2021. We're going to give you all the update price predictions on Zoomedica. You guys can tell we asked you all yesterday, which stock would you like to see a price prediction for? And 63% of the votes came in for Zoomedica. So we'll go ahead and do a price prediction for that stock. But before I do, let me give you all the heads up as to what our portfolio looks like real quick. I want to give you all a very quick snap snapshot of what the price the profits the loss that is going on in our portfolio right now three out of five you guys can see we're down two of them we're seeing some green so we're going to continue to watch these stocks as they trade out and every weekend we'll come in and reevaluate reevaluate them to see if we need to keep it in our portfolio do we need to get rid of it and also which one we're going to add so make sure you keep it locked here to see how you're able to profit in the market so now, if this is your first time watching or viewing our content and you appreciate how we're giving you all the heads up as to where price is going to go before you head out, hit the like button, share the video, and also subscribe. We're here to make sure that we win in the market, plain and simple. We're not here to try to make friends. We're here to win in the market and beat the trap at his own game. The trap is the one you see on the bottom left side of my screen. He is trying to take our money, period. And it's vice versa. We're trying to take the money back from him. There's no friends in the market. We are trying to get the best, trying to get in the best position so that we can win more often and grab more profit. Okay. So now let's talk about Zoom Medica real quick. You guys can see March the 11th was the last time we did our video, March the 12th. It is in our video playlist for Zoom Medica. You guys can say we played a strength. And immediately, what, two, three days into our prediction, the market in Zoomedica actually came to our ultimate TP price of about 17 and a quarter percent right there. This is what I'm talking about predicting the market. We had to get in position on March the 12th in order to capitalize on the 16th. So four days into that prediction, the market actually came to our ultimate area TP. Actually, it came on the 15th of March. This is what I'm talking about. You need to be in position. So that is done. That is over. Let's go ahead and get rid of that. Okay. So now the first question I want to show you and ask you all is, do you think the market is going to hold the trend? That's the only thing that this video is going to be about for the most part is because we need to see the trap hold the trend right now. We break this trend, then the market is no longer following it. And we are breaking the prospect of us seeing a market in Zoomedica go higher in price if we break this ascending line. So keep that in mind. Okay, so even without us doing a prediction, if you see this market break our line, we understand that we are no longer expecting Zoomedica to go higher in price. All right. So now, obviously, over the last couple of days, you guys can tell that there hasn't been a lot of strength. So this ascending line is in jeopardy of being broken to the downside, which is cool because we can anticipate that we won't be caught off guard when the market in Zoomedica drops because we can actually see that come to fruition. And there's a couple of reasons why. And the main one is how we are not seeing this market given any demand indications coming through, right? This area right here is restriction in the market. So we really can't change the movement to the downside in Zoom Medica until we see the price break $2.25 all the way up here towards $240 for restriction. So $225, $240 is those areas of restriction. We cannot expect the price in Zoom Medica to go higher until we see the trap break those two numbers to the upside. Now let's look at the market on the three day time frame in here. You guys can even tell that there is restriction coming through around two dollars and 25 cents two dollars and 30 cents okay so if anything the best outcome that we can get outside of the market in zoomedica going higher would be for it to trade in a range okay you can see it right here even on the five day time frame that this market is finding a very hard lid at $2.25, $2.30. That is a very hard lid. I mean, you guys can tell out of these five day price bars, 
five of them the market could not even break above two dollars and twenty five two dollars and thirty cents we cannot change this analysis of going lower or trading sideways until we see the market break two dollars and twenty five two dollars and thirty cents to the upside those numbers give us the clues to everything consistently you guys can see consecutively we you can see how the market in Zoometica has traded five days worth of price action is each bar so five days so 5 10 15 20 25 days into Zoometica trading it could not even break about two dollars and 25 cents to two dollars and 30 cents that is massive because sooner or later the trap is going to get tired and he's going to get tired of trying to break price above two dollars and 25 cents and he's going to go on to a different price level which in this situation would be to the downside right so what do you all expect the market to do in Zoometica we're going to play the weakness now I'm not going to tell you that the market is extremely weak okay I'm not but we're going to play and expect the market to go lower in price at least to the point to where it's going to try to break this ascending line to the downside okay and here pretty much is where the market likes to find you know dollar 87 a dollar 90 cents and we're going to hold 225 to 30 as restriction in the market in Zoometica okay so this is what we're expecting we're expecting the market to break this trend to the downside in Zoometica we're going to bring it ultimately down uh, to a dollar eighty, but we would skim off a little bit around a dollar eighty seven in the market for Zoometica. Okay, so yes, we're going to play the weakness, but right now we're not going to play a lot of it. But if it continues on, then we can definitely see this market come all the way back down to around a dollar seventy in Zoometica. Okay, so I'm just going to play a little bit of weakness on this prediction here in Zoometica which literally would see the market start a trading range okay so now that's it this is what we're seeing into the market we're getting a position on the expectation as to where price is going to go and now it's your turn I want you all to tell us where do you think the market in Zoometica is headed so that you can get in position and also our subscribers make sure you maintain a profitability and as always trade different